One of the more unusual bunch rides that are out there, not for the courses that they ride each day, but for the out there guys who ride those courses. King's Men is just about full gas, leaving nothing out on the road on beach road. It's what it's all about. Righty hey, you bunch of forgotten circus donkeys! <laughs> Welcome to edition 564 of the King's Men Cup. It started one day when we came into St Kilda and I personally gave it a bit of a pop towards St Kilda, past what we call the brown sign, threw the hands in the air because I was first to the line and yelled out, I'm the king. And that sort of was a bit of a gag by all the guys and the coffee just started calling me the king. So from there people asked for their own names and uh, we started calling them all the king's men and that's how it started. A wise and very popular man once said, life is made up of many moments, but it can be a single moment that makes your life. King, circa 2013. We give a speech at Morty Alley, which is really just to round up the troops and, and rev them up, but it, it started off as what was a, a logistical exercise to make sure people knew exactly what we are doing on the way back. But it's gathered a bit of momentum then, and it's more skewed towards firing the boys up and, and trying to get a bit of a laugh. Rumours have come to me that there are rides starting to rival our ride as the greatest ride in the universe. I've heard of rides called the Vuelta, the Giro, and a tour of France or something like that. But rest assured, they are a chasm away from the pinnacle of cycling, that is the King's Men. Tuesdays and Thursdays are our regular rides. We actually have a fixture, uh, two different rides, one called Full Noise and one called Daisy Day. Full Noise effectively means we roll down two by two to Morty Alec and then it's just full gas on the way back. If you cannot hold 50k an hour in the right hand lane, flick your elbow and get across to the left because there are others that can. So the King's Men recognises fantastic performances. We, uh, we have four seasons in a year and we have ranking points for each ride. At the end of each season, the person with the most ranking points ends up with the, the King's Men Cup. And once you've won the King's Men Cup, you're allowed to wear one of these yellow bands. And it's a, it's a mark of honour, a mark of respect. Not everyone's got one, but everyone wants one. There is one single man who presides above us all. He is the best of the best. He has herded all of his sheep into the slaughterhouse and he's ready for business. He sits here in the famous Kingsmen yellow jersey. It is none other than the farmer. It gives us blokes an outlet. It, uh, it keeps, us, keeps us honest on the road, but it's a great support network and we all keep each other fit and a lot of people have lost a lot of kilos through the Kingsmen and gained a lot of mates. Yeah, we lay down the challenge if anyone wants to come and have a ride with us and hang off the back. Good luck to you. Away we go, gentlemen. Good luck. Woo! Woo!